Howdy, folks. Welcome to the Wild West Crypto Show Daily Update. I'm Drew. I'm Brent. Brent, what the, well, tell us what's happening in the market today. I saw Bitcoin's a little red. Well, color your shirt. Everything's red. <laughs> I mean, there ain't nothing green. Not a soul. Well, wait. Uh, the U.S. government, uh, the, the one-year government bond is up. Oh, yeah. That's Who's it? buying government bonds? Well, nobody, because you're only getting 0.01% <laughs> return. But anyway, it's red everywhere. Bitcoin, uh, we're down 91, 25, yeah. 27, depending on the exchange. That's off about 0.8%. The market's off about 1.2, which means that the alts are giving up more headway than, uh, than Bitcoin. Dow's down 135. It is off of its lows for the days, but it's still down 135. 26,734 is it. 32,15 is S&P 500, down 11. And the NASDAQ 100 is at 10,575, and it's down 124. Gold broke below 1,800, so no it's kidding. 1,795. And silver even gave up 30 cents. And gold's down 0.6%. Silver took a big hit. It's down to 1.56 right now. Oh, yeah. Oil's yeah. at 40.70, so oil's holding steady around that 40, which kind of seems to be an equilibrium, and the futures are all negative. Uh, from the short all the way out to the long. So, folks, there you go. It's down, down, it's, down. It's a Debbie That's Downer a, day. It is. Hey, so so now you can look at this a couple of different ways. You can you can look at some of these things, and there's bargains. Yeah. You know, because they, they will they will bounce back. It's just are they bottom basement bargains yet? No, not yet. Not yet. Okay, okay. Hey, so so I, folks, and you're bound to have heard. Of the big Twitter hack yesterday that had Elon Musk and all these folks. And I actually saw a couple of those things come through, and I thought, that doesn't sound right. And that's where they went in and did a Bitcoin deal, and they hacked into all these different accounts of these real, you know, even Biden, and I think, and all that. So you can, Biden knows anything about Bitcoin? <laughs> but anyway, uh, the, so the question out there, was the hack good for Bitcoin? What they're saying is, and here's what I can't believe. So I don't know if you saw that or not, but people would go out there and they'd put on their send me send me some Bitcoin and I'll right. double it and send right. it back. And it's like who would ever you know do that? <laughs> but apparently, 120 thousand dollars worth of people did it. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So they actually did that. But some Bitcoin proponents believe the massive exposure is net for crypto, and that goes back to a Madonna thing. Oh yeah. All uh, publicity yeah. can have a good effect. I mean, so. you know, it, uh, in fact, you know, we uh, had the Miss Teen Crypto was yeah. on on our show we taped yesterday, and and you know she talked about uh, she doesn't get into the haters and everything. You know, if they're not talking about you, it's, you're not doing anything. That's right. I mean, That's you it. know, so uh, a little bit of the hate uh, doesn't hurt. It's advertising. You know, yeah. it gives them something to talk about. And if Biden didn't know what Bitcoin was, he knows today because he was hacked. <laughs> well, I'm not sure he knows today. No, well, he probably doesn't know, but he's heard of it. He's I'm sure heard he knows it. where he is today, but yeah, you know yeah. how that goes. What well, let's got? look here. Bitcoin investor sues the IRS, a man after my own heart, <laughs> and uh, for unlawful seizure of financial records at three crypto exchanges. So here you go. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? Bitcoin investor Jim Harper, he sued the IRS, its commissioner, a number of federal agents, and he alleged that they unlawfully seized his property from those three crypto exchanges. All right. <clears throat> he's filed suit. Uh, he's got some John Doe IRS agents included on the deal. And uh, the court document filed on July 15th with the district court. A jury trial is demanded. So all I have to say is, you know, uh, go, Jim. I was going to say, it's kind of near, go near to your heart. Oh, yeah. Not no. only suing the IRS, oh, yeah. but he wants no. a jury trial. No, no. Oh, yeah. He needs a jury yeah. trial. Yeah. Folks, if you ever have to oh. go to court for something, go to ask jury. for a jury trial. Oh, yeah. You bet. It oh, is yeah. your right. You In know? fact, you know, the interesting thing is most of our court system has become nothing but a negotiated deal of, oh, by the way, I added three felonies, and uh, oh, I pulled your child in. And, oh, yeah. Uh, you know, we got your dog. We're going to euthanize it. But if you'll sign over here, you know, go the distance, Jim. Uh, make them pay. Oh yeah, they they try to pressure. That's a Flynn deal. You know how they how they leveraged him to get to lie and say he was guilty. Yeah, was they were going to drag his son into the deal and all yeah. that. Now, folks, let me tell you something. Yeah, Stand up for your the, rights. Go to the distance. You exactly. Know. Don't yep. take the plea. And the other thing is, if they give you probation on other stuff and say you can sit thirty days or six days, ninety, sit in jail because that's a racket too. You know, they <laughs> they want that bed because if you stay there that long. You're going to be out in 30, 45 days because they need the bed for the next person they're putting on probation because they got a probation bill. 
and uh, especially in small towns in South Texas. I, I, I've never spent a night in jail, and there's probably a couple of times I should have, but, you know, I don't know that I'm interested in spending 30 <laughs> days there now. So, you know, a couple of good news things here. So one of them, is satellites are now aiding in the cleanup efforts by identifying and locating wow. the big plastic pollution, you know, the big debris. And I love I love the ad from those two guys that are out there, and they're all oh, muscled yeah. up. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, uh, yeah. Underneath all of this are Lamborghinis. Yeah, you yeah. Know? yeah. And, uh, but they go out there and, and they they make bracelets or whatever. Yeah. But now they're using satellites. Hey, you know, good use for satellites. I thought that was kind of a good story. Well, and you know, the, uh, people are interesting. They will figure out how to take technology and use it for good. Oh, yeah. Or they'll figure out how to scam people and use it for evil. Yeah. You know, and, you and, and guess what? It's not the screwdriver's fault which they choose. Yeah. You know, yeah. It's yeah. the man's fault of which way he uses it. And it's been that way since the beginning of time. That's a long time. Yeah, so it'll keep going on. Another thing, <laughs> listen to this. New design for rooftop wind turbines that drastically increases the amount of electricity. Folks, uh, you know, we big windmills out here in Texas and all that stuff, and you know what, it's the end of this day. We'll talk about this tomorrow. Have a good one, folks. Thanks for tuning in.